I'm Nancy Riley, and my husband and I moved to the Grand Rapids area about 28 years ago. We have three adult children. We have eight grandchildren that love coming to Grandma and Grandpa's house, so it's really joyful when they're around. I'm a retired teacher from Grand Rapids High School, and I still love working. So I'm, I think, blessed that I continue to work part-time when it works for me um, supporting the special ed staff. To begin with, I was not aware of the Moments That Matter program, but I just knew I had this exceptional nurse. And I wanted somebody to know that I had this exceptional nurse. And I just think it's so important to acknowledge those people that do an awesome job. So my journey to Grand Itasca was a result of a very, very busy week before I got here. I wasn't really feeling well, I was tired, and so I just assumed I was tired because I had been doing all this traveling. I'm a very avid walker. A couple of friends called me on Friday and said, want to go for a walk? I never say no, that's one of my mantras. So I said, sure, I'll go for a walk, and when I met up with them, I thought, I, I don't know, I'm just so tired. So I didn't go for a walk, and went home and slept most of that day Saturday felt horrible. I just knew I couldn't go another hour, so I came in through ER and then was admitted and diagnosed with pneumonia in both of my lungs and sepsis. It was a very quick journey that, and I didn't realize I was sick because I just don't get sick. I do remember being in ER and thinking, I just hope somebody admits, because, admits me to the hospital because I want to be taken care of right now and the timing was perfect for me. I had the most amazing nurse. Rachel just was here with me throughout the time I was hospitalized. Rachel made me feel like I was her one and only patient. I asked her, how many patients do you have? And I thought, oh my gosh, she's probably like this with every single patient, which told me it was truly from her heart. There was just that level of concern and care that she extends to her patients that goes way beyond just taking care of our blood pressure and our medications and so on. She was just genuinely concerned about my health. I just felt like everyone was really interested in me as a person beyond just what I needed in terms of my health care. And that really changed my perspective of how I feel about big hospitals versus the more rural community hospital. I grew up just a few miles away from Rochester, Minnesota, the Mayo Clinic. The healthcare system there is amazing and there are hospitals that are associated with them. So my thinking has always been, go big. That's where your specialists are, that's where they see everything. I have always left the community and went somewhere else to, bigger to have these things done. Certainly after my experience here at Grand Itasca, my comfort level, my confidence in doing things locally in my community hospital is really been reassured. I have a lot of confidence in the healthcare team that I have here and in my local community hospital. I'm Nancy Riley and this is my Moments That Matter story of my healthcare at Grand Itasca. Thank you.